Make a fine sailor. I won't lose to you. And second, I always pay my gambling debts. Pure reason for changing the car. Not more than four yesterday in this very inn at that very table. Rum and supper I never refused. Since yesterday, oh. it's stuck. He pulled as much as shit in an ice cream. What'll it be? What are you serving? Farewell. Salvation. How about that? It's the flea ridden mutant. Join us, please. Ravi loves company. Look how happy he is to see us. You happy, Ravi? Sure, he'd be happier if you stopped digging the point of that dagger in his back. Oh, you're just saying that because you don't know the situation. Our mutual friend, Ravi was just about to play for his life, and uh, Oh, you got the card! What else do you want? If you'd just given it up, instead of trying to cheat us, we'd be out of your hair already. As it is, that's all your fingers broken. So, it seems the witch will have to play for you. Sound good? <laughs> See? Lav is on board. What do you say? We add some spice to the Raise the stakes. Ravi's life and the Natali's card. Fancy that. Agreed. <laughs> and here I thought you'd be no fun at all. Let's play, let's play! Oh, 
how I'll repay you. Natalis card will do just fine. Oh, yeah. Maybe you prefer some other? Got a whole array you might like. I'm in a hurry. The Natalis card, of course. Here. Spend all night spanking board. So tired you're positively pale. Welcome. Welcome. What have you got there? So long. Things are generally tidier back in Colvia. Ah, you're here. How'd you make out with Ravi? Got the Natalis card. Excellent! Now we've just Caesar Bilzen to fleece, and we'll be home free. We'll do this. I'll chat him up while you sneak upstairs and search his cabinet of curiosities. Certainly keeps the card there. Can't we just buy the card off him? Doesn't that sound simpler? If I had a coin to spare, I'd sod off to Povis. Said Caesar'd never sell Fringilla. But don't you worry. He won't lose out on the deal. Got a bottle of Mahakam and spirit for him. A taste of the Motherland's finest is worth more to an expatriate than some silly card. Thought you said Caesar doesn't drink. No. I said it's hard to have a drink with him on account of his rarely leaving home. Also why he's liked to get pished as a priestess real quick. Three rounds and you could walk out with everything in that cabinet while singing the three maids of Vigo Varo at the top of your lungs. So what's in this cabinet? Ah, no man knows. You'll be the first to see it. I suspect it's either to do with buggery or metallurgy. But you can tell me once we're done. Let's go! Chivi! Caesar Belzen! I remember our quarrel about who's king of the Ponta. The Pike's king of the Ponta. Uh, well, you see, uh, I've come to convince you it's the catfish, and I do not come empty handed. Who's he? Well, him! Oh, that's, that's Geralt! Does say uh, Geralt fish? Yeah. Cast an earthworm the other day. Caught this huge perch. In the ponta! 
You betcha! Can't listen to this Hogwarts sober. Come in! So what the Zanders are eager biters if they taste like shite and soapy water? That's because you're about as good a cook as a goat's arse as a clarinet. It just recently, I took some fresh thyme. <laughs> and it tasted like thyme flavor shite. <laughs> Shut it. So, recently, I, I took this time. Get up! Care to chime in? How Xander taste to you? Happen to like Xander. Cause you're a witcher! What do you shove in them potions? Shit's a delicacy to use. <laughs> a witcher? Well then, did you hear Vibo Matilda last cast a pea and caught a young pike? Ah, cocksuckers lying like always. Ponter Pike aren't so dim-witted to go after his rotten peas. You need life beat. Your night crawlers, though the pike aren't as eager, don't know why. Once dug up a crawly so fat and lovely I started drooling. Would have eaten it myself? I'm not so sure. Hey, Geralt, what do you and your pals use up at Caer Morhen? Bombs. How's that? <laughs> well, I've heard many jests lately. Though, true enough, that one wasn't very funny. Geralt, go fetch us another bottle. Right. Can see the bottom of this one. So, when are we gonna go noodling for catfish? I'm done fishing with you. You forget what happened last time. What about last time? ceremony. Portrait of Emperor Amir, Temporal and Wood. 
Pretty flattering, I'd say. Sultan, time we were on our way. Uh, I suppose so. It's grown late. Wait now. Leaving already? Where's that bottle you went to fetch? Greetings, Belzin. We have a message for you from the boss. Message? What kind of message? Mr. Cleaver's very unhappy. Uh, now, just a minute. If any discrepancies have cropped up in the books, I can explain everything. Too late. Grab him, and you two get lost. Leave him alone. Well, up to it, lads. Have they got all day? I feel for your man, but she bore you. this to Cleaver? I'd recommend a letter. Right. <laughs> Got a pack. Good luck then. Farewell. Oh. Ah, you've a soft heart after all, Geralt. Oh, by the by. Splendid job with that last one. Blood splatter nearly hit the ceiling. Looked through Caesar's cabinet upstairs. And? No wonder he wasn't eager to show it off. Nilfgaardian armor, a portrait of Emir, Joachim de Vet's skull, Vatier de Rideau's dagger, the rope they hanged Skellen with. Oh, oh, oh shit! Disgusting fellow. To think I shook hands with him. Uh, but did you happen to take the rope? I know a few would pay a tidy sum for it. Some go in for that sort of thing. No. Ugh, if you say so. Also found a figurine. Nilfgaardian soldier. Magic spell on it of some sort, but I can't tell what kind. Triss ought to know. Triss is no longer around. So, got the full set of cards. What now? Now we collect a shitload of coin for them. Let's go. The exchange. We should do it right quick. Afraid your client might change his mind? Oh, I'm more likely to. Had so many buyers for these cards, I felt like the bell of the ball. So the buyer, who is he? A friend of a friend. Don't know much about him, but he's of juke silk. No doubt about that. <laughs> you know me, Geralt. I'm not prejudiced against anyone. As long as they pay. I will cleanse them all. Oh, I can't wait to get the King of Beggars out of my wheel. Ah, at last. I fear the body's gone cold. What is this? Your would-be buyer handed us his coin and departed. More or less in that order. Now... The cards, please. I trust obtaining them wasn't too troublesome. Try it and find out. <laughs> you wish me to try? I'm not as foolish as Earl. You ought to know that by now. Get to work, boys. The dwarf I wish to have alive. I must have a chat with him. Doing it. Geralt, bastards getting away with my coin. Damn it, with our coin. Chase the horse, son. I'll tend to the others. Rumble time!
something like that there. But all from that mood does out. What? Can't understand a word. Is that a threat? Put them close. Oh, no! Can't get away, Duke. Might as well stop. Drowners. You could use a witcher. Ha ha. Highly amusing. If... If I give you the coin, will you leave me be? No. Rather make sure this was our last meeting. So, you get them? You get the coin? Yes. And what about Duke? Finish him off? Mm-hmm. Ah, oh, that's grand. Well, Geralt, what's your preference? Coin or cards? I never managed without you, so you choose. If you want gold, it's not a problem. I'll find another buyer for these cards in a flash. Kinda curious how the cards might serve me. Excellent! I'll take the coin to the King of Beggars right away. Surprise the prick. Good luck, Sultan. Thanks, Geralt. And remember, the catfish is the king of the Pontar.